All right, folks, so today we're gonna cook these instant noodle with bean sprout. But first, we're gonna go catch some fish like this. And then we gotta clean the fish. And then we're gonna pan fry the noodles and it'll look just like this. Looks awesome, doesn't it? All right, so let's do it. Okay, so first we're gonna set up our rig and I'm gonna use these number four uh, Gamagatsu circle hooks. For the circle hooks, you wanna make sure you get the inline one. They work a lot better. And I'm using circle hooks because they hook it right on the mouth, so that way it's just easier to unhook them. Now that hook eye right there, that's pretty small, so it's kind of hard to get that loop right through that eye. So what you do is, you get some mono line and you loop it through that hole there, okay? And then you come up, so that way you just, you just thread the, uh, line through that eye like a needle so that way it's just easier to pull it right through that eye it's, when you're using thick line you can't put it through that eye without some help so there we go just like that okay so there's my rig right there i'm using two hooks and i'm using a two ounce disc sinker these hooks are tied on a high low rig and they're about 10 to 12 inches apart all right, let's go catch some fish. I think that's a fish. Yeah. It, he's hardly fighting. Are you a fish or are you something else? Yeah, that's a fish. That's a fish. There we go. Could be the one you lost. I don't know how big he is. Caught this fish about maybe 10 minutes. Gotta be careful, I don't wanna lose him. I'll let that wave bring it in. Okay, come on, buddy. Are you a keeper? Are you big enough? Are you big enough? Are you big enough? Oh yeah, ah, he's a little guy. Just a little guy, dang it. There we go. Well. Little or not, we're gonna keep him. There we go, first fish. All right, folks, there's my first fish. See, the circle hook, it gets him right on the lip right there. So it's just easy to, to remove the hook when you use it. It's pretty awesome. Oh, there we go, folks. There's a fish, there's a fish number two. Fish number two. Woo! Jay's got one. Jay's got one on two, we got a double. We got a double going here. Early morning high tide. We got a double. I think this might be a keeper. I'm just gonna walk back on the beach and let the wave bring him in. That's a nice head shake right there. I bet you he's a keeper. Oh, where are you, buddy? Oh, Jay's got a nice one. This one's not bad. Well, he could be bigger, but you know, all right, folks, I got a little one here, but I'm going to keep him anyways. And Jay's got a bigger one. That's a nice catch. It's about 12 inches. That's... Yeah, sweet. So this is my second fish. That's your second fish? Yep, second, second keeper. I've got two other silvers, too. Oh, nice. Doing good so far. There we go. That's fish. Yep, that's a fish. Oh, he didn't take it very... Oh, man, what a fighter. He was pretty close, too. Look at that head shake. Hopefully he's the bigger one. Yeah, fish on. Third fish. Let's see if I can land this guy. He feels bigger than the last one. Oh. Is it a double or what? Is it a double? Could be a double. Yeah, it's a double. <laughs> it's been a long time, but I finally got my double. There we go, folks. Double of the day. Nice yeah. Little guys, but I'm gonna take them no matter what. So this will be my third and my fourth fish. Woo! Okay, there we go, folks. That's my first double in a long, long time. These fish aren't very big, but I'll tell you what, they are super, super good. Oh, there we go, there we go, number six. Woo! Back to back. 
Number six. Potentially number six, that is. Let's see how big he is. Let the wave bring him in. Boy, what a beautiful day. With these fish, guys, when, when they bite, I'm not jerking the pole at all. I'm not making any big hook set because these are circle hooks. They're gonna hook themselves. There we go, just like that. Number six for me. A little small, we'll let him go, I think. It's a little guy. Oh, there he goes. He's gone. Oh, there we go. There we go. Fish. But however, I can tell he's not a very big one. I think he's kind of small. Maybe. Oh, maybe not. He's shaking his head pretty good. Or it could be a double. No. Nope. Okay, there we go, number seven. Easy, buddy. Easy. There we go. There we go, folks. This is fish number seven. Good size right there. Okay, guys. So we're going to clean up this fish, and I'm just going to fillet it. Well, I hope you can see me. It's kind of dirty, but one of those things where we really have no choice so when I'm filleting these red tail I start with one side and I just cut along the back and then along the backbone so we got that side now we're gonna flip it over and then I leave the other fillet on to give a support and then I do the same thing just cut along the back and then just cut along the backbone there are many ways, but this is how I do it. People tell me like an electric knife works better too. All right, there's our filet right there. All right, so there's our filet right there. We have enough for two servings. All right, so I'm gonna season the filet really quick. Right there is good enough. All right, there's the fish cooking. I don't, really want, I don't think we want to take this drink beer. <laughs> we gotta have the beer in there. Alright, so that is about almost done right there. Once it starts to flake like that, then you know it's done. It doesn't take much. Probably about two minutes on each side and you should be good. I don't know about you guys, but outdoor cooking is pretty awesome on the beach. No, I, I deleted my Facebook account. Oh, yeah. I'm not a Facebook fan. Oh. Alright folks, so the fish is done. So I'm going to scoop it to one side. I'm going to just put it on this plate. Okay, so in the meantime, I'm going to cook the noodle. Okay, so I got... <laughs> I got... <laughs> okay folks, <laughs> I got instant noodles. We're going to cook instant noodles. <laughs> We it's a uh, it's Indomie Mi Goreng whatever that means I don't know but we're gonna give it a shot. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna cook the noodles. I'm gonna put a little bit of water in here. Probably that's all I need right there. That's more than enough. I'm gonna turn up the heat so to boil faster. Yeah, that's looking good. This little stove, man, it's really powerful. I really like it. I bought a lot of stove off Amazon, a, a lot, and so far I like this one the most because the uh, arms, it's got four arms and it's kind of wide, it's about, looks like it's about eight inches across, so that means it's just more stable because the arms come out uh, wider so there's uh, less chance of tipping, so that's really nice, I like this stove a lot. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna is, put is in on? this noodle because the water is boiling really good right there And I don't have too much water. I should have left the other water I should have left the water in there, but I'm gonna lift it up and kind of flip it. I want this to get soft 
we're gonna be cooking a dry noodle, so I don't want to add too much water on here. Yeah, it's going. Okay, there we go. Now they're getting soft, so that's what we want right there. They're not quite done yet. We've got about another 40, 50 seconds. Then they should be nice and soft. And then we can toss in a bean sprout. All right, so that's going good right there. I'm gonna add in some bean sprout. Right there, heck yeah. Heck yeah. You like bean sprout? I love bean sprout. Okay, now we're gonna do the seasoning. Now we're gonna do the seasoning. There we go, right there. This is the soup seasoning that came in the packet? Yep. Then we got the soy sauce and the uh, chili. Right there. And there's the main ingredient. Right there. This is gonna be a dry noodle. Uh, and you know what? Dude, I forgot the fork. Oh, <laughs> well, you got a plate? Let's see. Here, before we eat with our hands. Okay, good. Okay, we're gonna add some chili, and I'm gonna add some, uh, some cilantros, and a little bit of garlic. Okay, now we're gonna add the fish. Right there, look at that. Is that yummy or what? Man, it looks so awesome. Yeah, man, right there. There we go. Woo! Hot dog. <laughs> All right, there we go, man. You looks ready, Looks awesome, Jay? yeah. It looks awesome, oh, PK. Right there. So we got, we got perch. We, I got some chili here, and noodles, and bean sprout, onions, garlic, onions, <laughs> onions, and garlic. Ready? Yep. I didn't bring a uh, spoon or a fork, so Jay's going caveman style. Man, it is really good. Oh my god. Mm. Man, it's so fresh. Ugh. Oh, and that spice is great. Oh, yeah. It doesn't get much fresher. No, oh, it's man, really it's does. nice. <laughs> I've got to bring chopsticks, so he's eating with his hand. <laughs> yeah. Caveman style. You know, he's going to make some. Grab a couple oh, of branches. That's okay. I'm happy this way. That's true. Way. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, I'll see you around. Nice man. seeing you again. Right. Take, Take it care. easy. So delicious, so fresh. Mm. So two days in a row, catch and cook, huh? Awesome. Who did we have yesterday? Oh, we had the quesadillas. Oh yeah, the, yeah, the quesadillas. The quesadillas. Those were awesome. I love the onion. Yeah. The garlic. The bean sprout. And especially the red chili. Oh, absolutely. Woo! Gives it, gives it that little kick. Yeah. Right done just in time. Mm hmm. Time we got to take a lot of dirt. Like 25, 50 yards. That was a crack up when we first moved over. <laughs> first catch you get off fish. Hey, Jay, thanks for coming out, man. Oh, I had a great time, PK. <clears throat> Probably yeah. one of the best fishing days I've had this year. Yeah, we had good bites today. Caught a lot of fish. All right, folks, we're going to wrap it here. Hey, thanks for watching. I really enjoyed doing this video. Caught some good fish today. Good food. Great company. Great company. <laughs> I will see you next time. Have fun fishing. Tight lines.